New York Creek has a vampire problem. Duke, the ghost cop. No, not those vampires, these vampires. They're a couple feet long, very, very different. They are fish, no connection to eels, although they do look similar. They're called sea lampreys, though it's easy to see why some folks refer to them as vampire fish. They've been around for hundreds of millions of years, though their presence in waters near the Great Lakes is a little more recent. And they've apparently become a problem for fish in western New York's Cayuga Creek. Our partners at WKBW have more. They latch on to other fish, they then suck the blood out of other fish, and get this, in their adult lifetime, which is about 18 months long, they take down alone between 40 and 60 pounds of fish. To control the lampreys, WKBW reports members of the Department of Fisheries and Oceans Canada will apply lamprecides, chemicals that specifically target lampreys' ability to reproduce, to area creeks later this week. The vampire fish problem isn't unique to New York's Cayuga Creek either. Michigan's Traverse City treats its own creeks to control lampreys populations as well. The invasive fish can be found in all five Great Lakes. And for anyone worried about taking a dip in waters full of lampreys, worry not. They don't bite humans. For Newsy, I'm Sebastian Martinez.